All right, let's solve this for A. <clears throat> the first thing we need to do is we need to find what our LCM is. So we've got, over here we've got an A, we've got a B, and we've got a C. So our LCM is going to be A, B, C. So now what we want to do is we want to multiply that LCM of A, B, C into the numerator of all of these. So since we're multiplying all those tops by 1, it's just going to be A, B, C over A. So we're going to have A, B, C over A plus um, we multiply that ABC into here, and we're going to have ABC over B. And in that third term, we multiply that ABC by that last term in there, and we're going to have ABC over C. So we put that LCM into the numerator, and you see now we cancel. What cancels in our first term is A's, so those A's cancel out, and we're left with just... BC plus what cancels in our second two terms is going to be our B's and we're going to be left with AC equals in our third terms we can see those C's are going to cancel and we're going to be left with AB. Now I'll take a look at these three terms and we see alright we're trying to solve for A you see there's an A over here and there's an A over here. So what we're going to try to do is we're going to try to get our A terms on both sides. So I'm going to subtract AC from both sides. And on the left-hand side, I'm going to have BC. When you take a look over here, we can't put these two terms together, so we just write them next to each other. So it's going to be AB minus AC. Now I'm kind of in a tough point because you can see that I can't, I can't put these together I'm trying to solve for A, so what we're going to do here is we're going to factor out an A on that right-hand side. So let's take a look at what we're going to do here. We're going to take an A out. When I factor an A out here, what's going to be left when I take that A out? Remember, factoring is like dividing each of these terms by A. That's going to make these go away, and what's going to be left inside those parentheses is going to be B minus C. And I still have this BC over here. Uh, last step is you can see... I'm trying to get A by itself. You see there's this B minus C being multiplied. So we divide both sides by B minus C. And over here, these are going to cancel out. And we're going to be left with, um, on the left-hand side, we're going to have BC over B minus C equals A.